The Golden Dragon is the rarest pet in Skyblock, guarded by a gigantic red dragon. The only way to get it is to like and subscribe. Just kidding, I have a 15 point plan on stealing the egg from the dragon. First, I need to get into the Dwarven Mines. Last video, I captured 49 of the 55 pets for my zoo. Today, my goal is to finish the job. Five of the pets are deep in the mines. The Dwarven Mines are guarded by the lift operator. To pass, answer me this. Riddle 1. What is the meaning of life? To make small numbers get bigger. Correct. Riddle 2. Please click on the soup. Um... You may enter. Now I am inside the Dwarven Mines, but the Golden Dragon is deeper, inside the Crystal Hollows. The Crystal Hollows have tons of gemstones, no crystals, and to mine them I need a stronger pickaxe. My sandcastle shovel isn't good enough anymore. I need a breaking power of 7 to mine most gemstones. There are a few ways of getting this. Pico Nimbus, but it breaks after 5000 blocks. The Titanium Drill, but I need to be higher level, which leaves the Ruby Drill. It's slow, but strong enough to mine gemstones. I just need all of these materials to make it. Let's start with the Drill Engine. I got an enchanted iron block from murdering my iron gold. I stole three redstone blocks from redstone youtubers, golden plate from my golden bull, I bought ten treasureite from a trusted source, and for the refined diamond I stole someone's wedding ring and threw it into a furnace. Got all five of those and put it into the forge, it'll be done in 30 hours. To finish the drill I just need six ruby gemstones, ah, oh, they're so nice to look at. You know what else is nice to look at? The main menu of Ace Defender. The sponsor of this video is a high quality SRPG masterpiece. A secret robot party gang, wait no, it's a turn based RPG tower defense, like mixing paintball with a water balloon fight. The game has more levels than times I've disconnected from Minecraft. 2,000 levels! You can level up, combine heroes, and equip gear that makes you look tougher than Thor riding a shark. The game has not two, not four, but three game modes. Single player, explore dungeons and compete in trials. PvP, fight against other players to prove you're better than them. Though you won't ever beat me. Good try though, you really put in effort. And there's a four times gameplay speed to speed up the action. Look at this! I just coded a new hero into the game, Brenda the Demon Spear. She deals massive damage in all game modes and heals. Now look Look at this! I just coded the Realm of Deities, a brand new mysterious realm where you can build your own castle, develop technology, and build armies to loot endless treasures. On the Realm of Deities map, there are monsters that look like this, okay? They drop incredible loot and you can upgrade it using magical research. The stars tell me that the optimal time to download Ace Defender is in about, mm, 7 seconds. When you download the game from my link in the description, you will get 10 Royal Recruit tickets. Once you get to Chapter 2 Level 8, you can pull some very good looking rewards. Download Ace Defender and I'll make the other 50 days to this video. After 30 hours of playing Ace Defender, the drill engine is done, and I can start making the ruby drill to get closer to the golden dragon. Just look at how many words are on the item, it has to be good. It'll take one hour to be complete. In the meantime, I'll upgrade my mining tree, the heart of a mountain. I am 98% of the way there, have been for three months. I consider myself a professional at procrastination. I have two options to get XP, slay 100 goblins or collect 20 raffle tickets. And there is no raffle happening, so I guess goblins have to start protesting for their rights. Too late, I'm killing them all. I got so good at killing goblins, they now give me one percent more coins. I'm not really sure how that works, but I'll accept it. I did it. Heart of the Mountain Tier 4. Now I get two more mining buffs. I chose to break multiple blocks, and every time I mine diamonds, a noise plays. I'm outside the Crystal Hollows, and someone has left their armadillo pet mocking me because I don't have one yet. Oop, it's gone. It's been an hour, and my drill is fresh out the oven. To add fuel, you can use flowers, eggs, oil, or human bodies. I'm ready to go inside the Crystal Hollows. Let's go, Gwendolyn. Cool up the minecart. It isn't letting me. I'm clicking on it. Did I lag out? Oh no, it looks like you missed the minecart. You passive aggressive bitch! It worked the second time and I made my way to a magnificent destination. A disconnected screen. Here I am. The crystal hollows are split into five main sections, and I have started in the jungle. To get the golden dragon, I need to find the five giant crystals, one in each section of the hollows. And so I ran around looking for gigantic crystals. People are saying coordinates in the chat, but I don't know what they're for. Maybe sharing their favorite spots to play Ace Defender. Oh, I found the jungle temple. This seems important. I wonder where Dwayne Johnson is. To get in, you need a temple key, or you can just watch Lockpicking Lawyer. Click out of two. I'm inside the temple and it seems to be a huge parkour track, which is good news because I'm amazing at parkour. This isn't even sped up. I'm just so good at parkour that I can bend time and space while sprint jumping. Honestly, this has been quite fun. I wonder what treasure is at the end. Hopefully the willpower will improve myself instead of continuing a pattern of progresslessness. Oh, it's the giant purple crystal. Hell yeah. I just have to mine it up and then one out of five crystals found. Honestly, I'm surprised I found the crystal before I found Dwayne Johnson. He's in every jungle, I swear. I jumped in lava and rejoined to get out of the jungle and into a different section. This time I'm 
in the mithril deposit. Never mind, I'm in a giant pile of gold. Could it be home of the golden dragon? No, it's apparently the mines of Divan. I talked to a guy who gave me a metal detector and he told me to look for treasure. I see a small problem with using a metal detector in a pile of metal, but what do I know? I spent five minutes looking through the mine and found six gold nuggets. Nice. Apparently the metal detector makes a sound when I get close to treasure, but my Minecraft is glitched and has no sound. I have to restart it to get sound, but that will take me out of the mines of Divan. So I ran around like a blind person waving a javelin to find a doorway. But then something happened. A new indicator came up. Treasure 38 meters away. Maybe the game saw my struggle and felt bad for me. I went around finding treasures, gemstones, items, and even a what's up DVD. I also found the four missing artifacts and returned them to the keepers, revealing the second giant crystal. These are truly efficient drills to mine the crystals in one click, and I must have very large pockets. Then I found a lost city of robots firing lasers at me, but my power cut out and my footage corrupted. I swear it's true though. The next day I logged in and found Khazad Doom. Don't want to get copyrighted! And here is the boss, Bal, who drops the Bal pet. Very creative, guys. I fired him for five minutes and wasn't sure if I was actually dealing damage. So I hoped someone else could figure out coordinates and ask for help. And yes, my name is Sad Chicken because I'm trying to hide my identity. The passages loop around everywhere. I don't see how coordinates could help. Wait, there's someone down there. They did come to help me. He's dead. I'm sure it was mostly me. He barely helped. Killing Bal also unlocks the third giant crystal. I was worried I'd actually have to look for them. I have found a tunnel. It leads to the temple where you find the jungle key but I broke in so it's useless. The next crystal is guarded by the Goblin King. I'm gonna have to spend a lot of time looking for it. Or I can just use other people's tunnels and find it right away. Hail Goblin King. I would like to steal your giant crystal. Turns out his wife ditched him last week and he's fine with me stealing her jewelry. But I only have 20 minutes to find it before she wakes up. And the Queen's Palace is in a randomly generated place anywhere in the Crystal Hollows. But what if I use this tunnel? I wonder where it leads. Yep, it's the Queen's Palace. <laughs> These tunnel people are amazing. They must have tunnels leading to all the important places on the map. I have to get past this guard. He looks pretty tough. I told him that Ace Defender was a free-to-play mobile game and he went to play it. Yoink! Leaving only one crystal left. In the lost city of robots that shoot lasers, I told you it was real, but you didn't believe me. Now you look stupid. Never mind. This guy's name is Professor Robot. That's stupid. I have to kill these robot golems that have a chance to drop six robot parts. And I've already got five of the parts, so it shouldn't be too long. Okay, it's been 10 minutes. This is taking a bit too long. 15 minutes. 20 minutes. 30 minutes. I have gotten at least three copies of the other five parts, but can't get the sixth. I already gave one copy of the other parts to Professor Robot. Screw this, I'm doing the maths. The probability is one on six, and I've gotten 20 parts. There is a 97% chance that I would have gotten it by now. A less than one in 40 chance of me not getting it. I guess I just gotta keep farming. I'm not trying hard enough. <laughs> Wait, did I just... Did I just get a phoenix pet? That's a, that's a one in one million chance. <laughs> oh god. I got a one in a million drop, but I can't get this basic quest item. Obviously, I'm just not trying hard enough. I'll just keep farming. Wait, there it is. F Yes! Here you go, Professor Robot, and there's the crystal. I can finally leave. Wait a minute, is my screen... <laughs> <laughs> My screen was still recording probabilities, not Minecraft. After all that time, I wasn't recording when I actually got it. Uh, so yeah, I gave the part to Prof Robo and the crystal was in here. Can't tell if I'm exhausted or delusional from that. I tunneled back to the center of the crystal hollows to place the giant crystals. I've been through a lot to get all these and I can finally get the reward. Plenty of gemstones, but most importantly, the prehistoric egg. After walking a certain amount of blocks, hatch the armadillo pet. Perfect for doing my 100 block race over and over right past my zoo. And the helix. If I take it to the forge, I can turn it into an ammonite pet. It'll just take 12 days. That's two new pets. Then I went and killed Bal a few more times for his pet. There are only two Crystal Hollows pets left. The Golden Dragon and the Scarver. The Scarver pet drops from Scarvers that spawn when you dig tunnels. So I dug a while to find one, and here they are. However, this is a worm. A Scarver is a particular type of worm that spawns around 20% of the time. And so I mined. I mined as fast as my drill could take me. I mined past the dwarves and back up to the angels. I mined to the end of the world, and then I kept on mining. And I found another worm. Okay, so that's two worms and no scarvers. Let's do some more math. If I'm super lucky, one worm every five minutes. So one scarver every 25 minutes. Chance for the lowest rarity of scarver pet is 1 in 166. I have 150 magic finds, so it's about 1 in 66. So to have a 50% chance of getting a scarver pet, I need to kill 46 scarvers. 25 minutes for each totals 1,150 minutes. Or 20 hours. 20 hours of mining stone. I think we can agree that I'm already a bit too insane to go on a 20-hour mining spree right now. I'm gonna 
to skip this for a minute and go find the golden dragon. Now that I have mastered tunneling, I can use coordinates to find the dragon. I made my way to the exact coordinates he had told me. And it was a lie, there's no dragon here. Maybe if I use my real identity, people will be nicer. Ooh, 426 and 942. Nope, doesn't help at all. Well, I may as well look around myself for a while. Wait, what was that sound? It sounded like a roar and wings flapping. This is it. I found it. But then my power cut out and I lost all the footage. Just kidding. Here I am in the face of the great dragon. And here are his golden eggs. It's fine if I take one, right? He says I have to pay 500 million coins. Let's just do the math. The probability of me getting that much in one hour is nope. Can I offer you my DVD copy of what's up? Okay, I have a plan. I'm starting a GoFundMe. Wait, no, I don't have cancer. New plan. I need 500 million coins for the golden dragon pet and 800 million coins for the ender dragon pet and 20 hours of mining for the scalver pet. I'm going to do a 20 hour Twitch stream of me mining for the scalver pet and sell tickets to my zoo to raise money for the dragon pets. Buy tickets on my auction. Follow me on Twitch to see when it happens, but most importantly, download Ace Defender. Oh, I think my power is cutting out.